So lots of reopenings happening rapidly across the state in the low country. Places like nail salons will be allowed to reopen next Monday. Beaches reopened here in Charleston today. Also today, restaurants allowed to take a big step forward. News News' Hannah Powers joins us live from downtown Charleston. Hannah, big day today for the food and beverage industry. A big day, Brendan. It's been nearly two months since restaurants here in downtown Charleston were allowed to let customers eat inside. Now today, many of them finally able to reopen their dining rooms. But things do look a little differently. Dying to come back. And those customers are back at Tommy Condon's six weeks after their last big party on St. Patrick's Day. But now things are a little different. Owner Alan Vandal says to make sure everyone stays safe. The biggest changes are, you know, no ketchups on the tables. We do single serve ramekins, and uh, the cleaning schedule is a little more intense than normal. So we, anything touched by human hands, we hit with antiseptic spray. Spaced out tables, a 50% occupancy cap, and informational posters along the walls. A few more measures. Vandal says he's doing everything in line with how the state and Governor McMaster wants it. In, in order to be competitive, you have to you have to be following these guidelines, or you lose all your customers. Restaurant goers say living under the new sets of rules are hardly normal. It's it's only a little bit back to normal. It's going to be a very long time before we're actually back to normal. But even so, the ones I spoke to say nothing beats being back out on the town. But just the fact that I'm able to get out of my house is a blessing in itself. Just uh, get a beer from someone that's not myself out of my own refrigerator. It's it's a really good feeling. While lots of restaurants chose to reopen their dining rooms tonight, I spoke with a few others who are holding off a few more days and making sure they're taking every precaution and they will reopen later this week. Reporting live in downtown, I'm Hannah Powers. Count on two.